in June of 2011, I found myself um, entering uh, residential treatment for alcoholism. And while I was there, probably the biggest thing I learned was to ask for help. So one of the things I knew about was a place in Vancouver called Our Community Bikes. So I remembered that they helped people that were struggling with mental health issues or addiction. Either, yes, you're right, get a free bike or repair your bike. I brought this old bike and they didn't fix the bike for me, they taught me how to fix my bike. Obviously my bike became a really important part of my early recovery. I would ride it every day. So whenever I felt anxious or lonely or overexcited even, I could get on my bike and those feelings would disappear. So I started teaching people about the power of cycling and how they could get a free bike and how they were worth that help. Flash forward, I'm almost three years sober. So now I'm at a place in the program where I want to give people that experience. And so I ask people throughout Vancouver to donate bikes to the program. I call it a foster bikes program. I thought you'd be like, what are you doing bringing me this bicycle? This is a Raleigh, man. Okay, good. Woo! Are you kidding? I built this. Are you sure you're giving, you want to give this away? I want to give it away. Somebody's going to love that. Right? Whoa. Yeah, this is a sweet ride. There go. So what I'm going to do with the bikes now is to take people from the Portland Hotel Society's Drug Users Resource Center on guided rides. All I want to do in the beginning is to give people who don't have the chance to do this to go on a ride to the park with me. No pressure, you know, no definitive outcome. And without them even knowing it, they're going to get benefits of getting sunlight in their eyes, getting into nature, learning more about their city, building a group of friends who ride bikes. So the benefits that will happen from it are almost kind of like... Uh, secret you know like they, they don't they don't they these people and the people that go on these rides aren't going to feel like I'm lecturing them or, or anything like that but they will feel the benefits of, of what cycling can do